Well, today, what do we got, Billy? What do we got? I've got another delivery from Wild About Bunnies. So with Billy's changing diet, as you know, he needs extra help with his digestive issues. So with that in mind, I sort of got a few more things that I thought might be a bit more appropriate as well for his diet, just helping to build him up because he's really struggling to sort of <laughs> have his tummy in check. The probiotics have really worked and I've sort of changed up how I'm administering it. So before I was putting it in his water and now I'm actually adding it to his pellets. So adding a bit of water to the pellets and coating them with the probiotic. Because they said you can sprinkle it on food and things. And I thought, well, hello. <laughs> I thought, well, he might sort of leave bits of it. So I want to make sure he's having the full benefit on it. And that's really helped. The other thing that's really helped is, and this sounds a bit odd, but cutting down on the veggies. Like some rabbits, from what I've been reading about, they just can't handle a lot of greens. So I cut out greens for a few days and his um, poos returned to normal, really. They weren't sort of wet. I know, wet and moist. So they're, they're definitely back to normal. Um... That being said, I'm still sort of adding, I added a little bit of parsley yesterday night and instantly he had like a few moist poops and then it went back to normal again. So I thought, well, if I just give him a tiny bit every few days, then that's better than nothing and it makes sure that his digestive health is okay. So that being said, here is the haul that I've got. Right, so let's just dive right in. So I haven't had a look at it yet. Ooh. I can already see something that I didn't order, so this must be a sample packet. So let's have a look, because I can't really remember my order anyway. <laughs> so this looks like a sample of adult rabbit food. Now I know that Billy used to have the junior version of this brand, the Science Selective, and he really liked it. So this is the adult rabbit one. So at the moment he's on the Burgess Excel rabbit nuggets, So and they seem to be really working well for his digestive system at the moment. but. Be nice to try, maybe. I mean, you meant to sort of gradually introduce them to things like that, so I'll have to be careful. But really nice them to send me a sample. I'll have to have a look at that. So we've got a loofah carrot. So I got two things that are board and busters that are loofah because Billy's really not into chewing willow sticks or willow reefs or anything like that. And I thought, well, there's got to be alternative. There must be other things he's into chewing, just to encourage that chewing. He likes his things that I hang inside his house that have like, um, they're really hard. So they're good for him for gnawing. And he does really love those. Like he had a, um, one that looked like a piece of corn that was hung up. And then he's had another that looks like a string of, of nuts. It's not actual nut, but you know what I mean? It's it's like, looks like nuts. And he loves chewing on that. So I thought I'd try with loof. So I've got a little mini loofah carrot. And I got him this, which is the boredom breaker carrot dream catcher how cute is that that's gorgeous so even if he doesn't chew it that looks really nice <laughs> but he's hoping he's into it so i'll try with those later so next up we've got chamomile because as you know billy is not a fruit rabbit he's a flower rabbit so he's really into his chamomile i noticed that when i have chamomile tea he goes nuts for the smell and everything so i'll try with actual chamomile flowers um, encourages the foraging as well so I'll put it in with his hay like I did with the marigold so see if he likes that lovely and then they say to encourage hay eating sort of offer alternatives and I haven't tried oat hay with Billy so I thought I'll try with some oat hay see if he likes it so I got him the oxbow oat hay brand and I've got two bags of that so that's the oat hay lovely then i got him some meadow munchies oh wow big box <laughs> so these are meadow munchies nature snacks with dandelion and chamomile and as you know he likes dandelion and chamomile so another healthy alternative compressed high quality meadow feeding hay yay so again with fiber i just thought it's another alternative and as you know, Billy loves his flower forage, so I got him another one of the wildflower forage packets because he's nearly finished his other one already. <laughs> he's currently nibbling on that hay roll. There you go. Do you remember my last video for my haul? 
that I got with Wild About Bunnies. I got him the hay roll. He absolutely loves it. He pushes it around all day. So, and then I got him, oh, luscious leaves. So a delicious mix of dried green leaves. So I thought I would try him on these because obviously his fresh veggies, um, he's got such a delicate tum. So I thought if I could try him with these, it's any way to get fibre in him in a healthy way, really. And then last but not least, I got some green oat. Let's have a look at this. This is the Natural Choice for Animal Lovers Friendly Brand Green Oat Ready Grass. So it's a nutritious alternative to dried grass or hay. So again, it's just another form of fibre. I thought I'd try and with it. So let's see what Billy thinks. Well then, Billy, what do you think of these? Hey, oh, you love the carrot. What's this? Unusual, isn't it? What about this? What do you think of that? Having a good sniff. Yeah. <laughs> I think he likes it. <laughs> so I'm gonna hang these in his home. Then he can yeah have a little nibble. So yeah, I think he's into loofah. He's definitely more interested in what he's being to things like the willow and stuff, so Shall we try some new hay? Shall we try some new hay? Right then, so let me have a sniff of the oat hay. Oh, I'm in a nibble. Right here. Let's just see what it Oh, straight in there. <laughs> I've heard it's a good alternative because it doesn't have loads of the protein and calcium. It, it's literally really fibrous, so don't worry about the mess. <laughs> My house feels like a barn anyway. There's that much hay lying around. So yeah, I think he's into that. Lovely. So I'll mix this in with some of his normal hay. And this will increase the fibre. Lovely. Lovely, Billy. Where do you like it? I've given Billy a bit of a sample of all the different haze and he's really going for the mix of the oat haze so you've got the ready grass which is the really green one and the oat haze just underneath and he seems to really really enjoy it so nice bit of variety on the meadow hay variations that i've got and billy seems to be really happy so i'll keep an eye on his digestive system see how it goes um but hopefully he'll be okay Last but not least, I'm just going to try one of these Nature Snacks Meadow Munchies. So they come in these, they look like hay barrels. <laughs> so I think Billy's going to really enjoy these. So I'll stick one in the living space, put it on his mat, all his other things, and see if he goes for it. I tend to put a few things out each day, change it round so he doesn't get bored. And obviously... He really enjoys that. It seems like something fresh each day for him to get his teeth into. So I'll see if he likes it. Billy! Billy! What's this? What's this? Ooh! Oh, having a nibble straight away. <laughs> it's on Happy Bunny. Haven't you been spoilt today? Haven't you been spoilt today? You're covered in hay. Look at you. Look at you. So that's one happy bunny. So thank you, What About Bunnies. Obviously this video is not sponsored, but they're just a really good company. I'm going to continue to buy lots of things for Billy from them because they have such a good variety. So check it out. Check their website out. It's a great variety of things, especially for rabbits that need that extra bit of care and support. So fab. So say bye-bye, Billy. I'm munching away.